Hi, I'm Lee Iridium. Hope you're doing all right today. It's reaction time. I thought I wouldn't get any videos in before Christmas, but I'm going to try. So I'm at work, as you can see. I'm on break. I've got my cup of tea. Mm, that rhymes. I could be a lyricist. I really could. It's amazing. Anyway, um, when I usually do stuff from the car, it's usually like older stuff. Um, I try to, like, if I'm doing newer stuff and reviews, I try to do them from indoors, look a bit more professional. <laughs> But when I do the older videos, I try and I just do them in the car usually, you know, trying to catch up with stuff on the long list of 25 things I have to do. <laughs> so, um, going to a recommendation, and I'm going to try a lot cover different people on the recommendations. I've got a long list, like I said, and different people recommending songs. So I'm going to try and give everyone a shot. Um, so this comes from Kenneth. Um, and he's asked for tall stories somewhere she waits uh, for love. He says somewhere she waits for love. I think it's called somewhere she waits. What I saw on the video, but I don't know. It's either somewhere she waits for love or somewhere she waits. It doesn't matter. <laughs> so tall stories. And all I know about this band, because Kenneth also told me, which has plucked my ears up a little bit, is Steve Orgeri, um fronted this band, singer in this band on the debut album on this song. So, I love Steve Orgeri's voice, man. Sorry about the stirring of the tea. You know, I've got to get me breaking as well. I, I just thought the the um, Arrival album, I think that's what it's called, by Journey, is such an underrated album. Um, Steve Orgeri vocal, man. I mean, there's a lot of uh, Panida fans, which I am one of them as well, by the way. But I think, I think if Steve stayed with the band longer, I think he would have gained, you know, more popularity in the journey uh, with the journey fans because I think he deserved it. He's brilliant vocal, and for some reason, when they did, did the next album, they used him less and they split the vocals between the band, which was just fucking weird. I mean, they should have stuck with Steve or Gary because he's got an amazing voice, absolutely amazing. So, without further ado, Tall Stories, Somewhere She Waits for Love. Here we go. Somewhere she waits for love. What a voice, man. Somewhere she waits for
it's a nice, it's a lovely song in it. <laughs> I mean, it's just pure soft rock or AOR or whatever you want to call it. It just, it's just really nice to listen to. And I think sometimes, and the same can be said for Journey sometimes as well. I think I love Journey and uh, I love this song, but I think the voice elevates it. And so it should, you, you know, when you've got a great singer like Steve Perry or Panida or Steve or Gary, it, um, it elevates the song into heights where you probably, if another singer who was, you know, half as good, you maybe wouldn't pay as much attention, but sometimes it's really about the vocals and man, he's got a, such a great vocal. I mean, this was a few, I think this was a few years before he joined Journey, probably maybe five or six years. And I think his voice even sort of matured even more, like when he went into Journey. I mean, just sort of that tone was just beautiful tone he's got. He's got that here, but it's like the makings of it. But it's a very cool song. I mean, I like I said, I can listen to sometimes, you know, the best singers. I'm not saying it's a bad song or anything, but I I think I can listen to the best singers over some half decent songs and it just elevates it and I love listening to it but just because purely because of the singer and I think you know Steve or Gary in this is just amazing and I could just listen to this all day you know what I mean it's just absolutely brilliant I love his voice man the song itself is pretty good it's very sort of you know really mellow in it I mean this is probably about as mellow as I could get <laughs> without going into you know the pop music side um, I'm not saying it's pop but you know there's not much heavy about it, which is fine. It's AOR. It's meant to be this way. But I said his voice, man. It's just so smooth. It's just so smooth. It's very cool indeed. So um, let's, let's listen to the rest of this. Probably going to get really heavy and freshy now. <laughs> Maybe. Yes, loved it. Absolutely loved it. I'm, even the more near the end there, where he was reaching, going for the higher notes and stretching a little bit more, you could really hear that. You know, I mean, why Journey got him. You could really hear that Steve Perry sort of um, vocal there. I don't know. It's, it's weird, isn't it? I mean, there's so many singers. You sometimes think, sometimes people accuse singers of, you know, copying or, you know, he's just trying to sound like someone. But how many thousands of singers are there and if someone's going to open their mouth and sing and sound like someone else? 
you know, and whether that's the case with Steve Algeri or he's trying to sound like um, Steve Perry, who, who will know, only he will know. But, I mean, it's just, there's so many different singers, like I said, someone's going to sound the same, aren't they? You're going to have a lot of people sounding the same, and you do. And um, I just think it's one of those things, and I, I just, man... I just, I just loved that song. It was very relaxing, man. <laughs> I know it's like this is a rock and metal uh, channel, but man, that's rock. That's soft rock. That's AOR. Uh, and that's just, you know, I really can listen to that sometimes. I can listen to that as, as well as I can listen to heavy music, you know, and it just does the same for me. It makes me feel a bit different, but it's very relaxing, very cool. Um, very subtle do you know what I mean very cool song indeed thank you very much Kenneth for um, asking for that Kenneth's asked for a few but I'm just trying to get through the list like I said but a great song absolutely loved it really enjoyed it what do you think of this Tall Stories I think it says Somewhere She Waits that's what it came up at the beginning of the video it might be Somewhere She Waits for Love I'll have to check that out <laughs> but what do you think of this song in the comments let me know I loved it in the comments below and I'll see you next time.